Hi there. Um, I thought I'd add to my series of um, grooming videos that I made uh, a couple of years ago at the beginning of lockdown. Um, I thought I'd add um, a preparation for a show uh, series. Um, that'd be very basic and I'm quite sure you'll see lots of other sort of people talking um, in much more depth and giving you different ideas and you know everybody has a different idea of, of, of how to present and how to, or to how to prepare the coat but I just thought I'd give you a very basic sort of outline of what I do with, with my dogs. Um, so um, the breed standard says that the Legato coat should follow the outline of the body um, and should be a rustic appearance. So you don't want to be to want heavily sort of um, sculpted dogs. You don't want them to be all fluffy. You need to need the to an idea of the you need to be able to see the curl definition um, there's a feeling of the, a nice texture to it so no fluffing out no I mean I don't touch my dogs um, with a comb um, you know as close to three days before a show I, I won't go anywhere near them with a comb once I've done this groom today so he's got a show on Sunday we are what day is it today it's Wednesday so I will um, brush him through um, I will uh, give him a trim, uh, he'll then go in the bath, uh, have a good, good bath and saturate this coat so that the coat will form the curls and then that's it, I won't touch him with a comb after that. Um, that's just the way I do it, I know some people like to fluff them up, comb through their beards, but I don't, I'm afraid I just leave them um, as, as, as natural as possible. Um, so before I start, so if you've got a very matted coat you could start by putting them in the bath and then putting lots of conditioner in the coat and then going through the coat with a comb just teasing it through with with the wet coat with conditioner um, that's one way of doing it you can then blast the coat with a with a dryer to open it up as you dry it so that and and fluff dry it which is a groomer's term in which case you're straightening the coat so you've got an oral idea of the length so you can then you you can then trim it but obviously after that you have to saturate the coat give it time to to relax again and um, form the curls and that can take when, when you've blasted and straightened the coat that can take several days if not more than a week or so to 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 recover so i don't tend to do that because i don't let my coats get to the point where they're so, they're so far gone i have to do that to to get rid of any matting um, so i go through the coat every two or three weeks with a comb um, and i like to do it dry because i'd much prefer to trim them dry uh, you can use sprays there are all sorts of hydrating sprays that you can use um, and you know I do use that sometimes um, I'm not going to today because I don't want to wet the coat I just easier I find it easier to, to trim it when it's when it's dry um, so um, yes um, so 